All right, so I've got a 2000 Mazda MX-5 or Miata, and it's acting really funny. It has been for like a week now. I was just driving on the uh, highway pretty hard, but the engine just kind of seemed like it crapped out on me and it was really rough. So I'll give you a little show what goes on when I turn it on. turns on just fun idles eh. let's jump around a little bit when I'm in neutral it doesn't really jump around too much but as soon as I put it in drive this car starts shaking I have an automatic transmission by the way yep you can hate on it I hate it too all right I'm gonna put it in drive now you can see the rpm shaking around a little bit more I don't know if you could hear it or not. I have the top down. So hopefully you could hear, but. All right, so this is what happens when I start to drive. See, this is idling right now. No, no pressure on the gas. Now if I put like, maybe like 5% throttle. I can get it to go, just, just a little bit. All right, we're just gonna go down here. So right now I'm giving about 5% and you can hear it just going away over there. And uh, I went to the dealership, well not the dealership, but uh, auto shop and they said there was a catalytic converter, they did the engine check engine test, they evaluated it and they're like, yep, it's your catalytic converter. So I went and bought a new catalytic converter, got it put in, same with the O2 sensors and nothing, no changes, same deal. So, I'm not really sure what this is, but, all right, getting about a little more this time. Slowly going up. Now watch what happens when I put just a little bit more gas on it. Nothing. Is that like 30%? It's slowly, now you, you would think there's a clog, but I literally just put in brand new catalytic converter. Magnaflow. I mean, I'm stumped. I don't know what this could be. That's why I'm coming to you guys, because Pet Boys doesn't know either. New, new O2 sensors. New converter. What could it be, guys? What could it be? All right. One more thing. Also, what I noticed is if I just, what was that? If I just slowly, slowly put my foot down a little bit more instead of just jam it, I can get a little speed without it just fluttering. But as soon as I go too fast, it'll just start sputting on me. So, yeah, like I said, please help me. 